I'm inside Carnesec Arena where the St. John's men's basketball team are taking on the Fordham Rams, one of New York City's oldest basketball rivalries. This is the Red Storm's third game in seven days. They defeat Tulane and Cal State Northridge the past two games. They're looking to get back to their winning record. The Fordham Rams are 5-4 and four overall and are coming off three straight losses. They're looking for their first win away from home this season. This is the 88th time both teams are meeting. St. John's came out aggressive with Shamari Pond sinking at three, three, 30 seconds into the game. The Red Storm continued to dominate in the offensive zone when Federico Mussini scored and drew a foul three minutes into the half. The Red Storm started to get sloppy, turning over the ball three times in the offensive zone. Fordham was able to catch up within a point to St. John's with a score of 34-33, just under three minutes left in the half. St. John's wasn't done yet when Mussini drove toward the net, made the basket, and drew a foul two seconds left, giving St. John's a 42-33 lead at the end of the half. St. John's came out even more aggressive in the second half, going up 50-36 to three minutes in after Ponzes continued to put on a clinic, sinking another three. Mussini sank two three-pointers in a row, and St. John's ran away with the game. Elijah Holyfield subbed in the game last minute, and yes, you guessed it, he sank a three to end the blowout. After an exciting game, the St. John's Red Storm defeat the Fordham Rams 90-62. to Three was the magic number tonight, with the St. John's putting on a three-point clinic and going on a three-game winning streak. Their next game is against LAU Brooklyn at the Barclays Center this Sunday. I'm Anna Klesa for Sportswire, WRED-TV.